Only on 10 Tampa Bay, a local family heartbroken after a weekend crash in Plant City killed five people, including a one-year-old and a 12-year-old. Florida Highway Patrol says two cars collided, then a tractor trailer crashed into them off State Road 39 and Bruton Road. As 10 Tampa Bay's Megan Myers tells us, the family is now planning several funerals. Seven members of the Funes family were heading home from Disney World when they got into a bad crash off of this road. Four family members didn't make it and now three are in the hospital trying to recover. The family says all of this has been unimaginable. I just received a call um, uh, around uh, one o'clock in the morning. That phone call changed everything for the Funes family. I was in panic. I, I didn't know what uh, to say, what to think. These three family members, 54-year-old Lillian, 12-year-old Feria, and one-year-old Alessandra, all died in the crash. 20-year-old Joe Bett also passed away. It's hard for us, you know, it's, uh, it's a lot of things and we don't know how to do it. Jose Funes says the three other family members in the hospital are slowly getting better. I hope that, uh, you know, that they uh, get better and uh, come back home, you know. Including the one-year-old baby girl's mom who is at a hospital in Lakeland. He says she just got taken off a ventilator. She's asking for the little girl and she asked now for her, but uh, we don't know what to tell her. He says his family is leaning on each other to make it through this heartbreak. If anyone has a problem, it's a problem for the family, not just for the, for the person, you know. In Plant City, Megan Myers, 10 Tampa Bay. So sad there, the, uh, the fifth person who died in the crash was a 53-year-old man from Valrico.